up everybody how you doing today <coughs> doing pretty well here gonna try and get a ride in before it rains pretty much got rain all over us Alright guys, topic today is road etiquette and road rules. We all know that cyclists and motorists are supposed to follow the same rules. However, sometimes a cyclist needs to use good old-fashioned common sense and road smarts. So, if you see here, <clears throat> I ride on the right-hand side of the road. That's the smart thing to do. I took a left here. Didn't use hand signals. I'm on a side road. And I don't always use them. Stop sign. It was a decent little stop for these type of roads. Starting and stopping for a bicycle is way different than when you're in a car. And there's a lot of times it just makes sense for a cyclist to kind of ease their way through a, a stop sign. Alright guys. Another situation where rules and etiquette come into play is when you're in a graveyard. Again, even though it's not a highly trafficked road or anything, try to stay on your side, which would be the right side if you were in the United States and some other countries. And yes, it is starting to sprinkle. Try to stay on your side. I don't think you have to on a road like this out here in the cemetery. Okay, that's good practice. Also, have bugs run into you like that. Splatter on you. Possibly bite you and kill you. Maybe I'll be alright. There's a bug on me. Let me know. What you don't want to do is ride in the grass. You don't want to do that. That's bad etiquette, bad manners. Let's try to keep doing that. And also notice, I'm wearing my safety glasses that I talked about in my last video. I'm wearing my reflective vest and my gloves. <laughs> All that good stuff. If we could all try to be more respectful and concerned and take care of one another, we'd have a, a lot better world. And we'd have a lot better time out here while we're trying to simply just enjoy ourselves. You know, uh, some of us are out here for different reasons. Uh, some of us are out here for depression, which is a lot of my reason. I also have always wanted to be a cyclist, so. so you never know what people are going through. Think about that before you act like a jerk to somebody. More etiquette. More common sense. 
If you have a shoulder, ride in the shoulder. Pay attention to your surroundings because they're not paying attention to you. More etiquette. More common sense. More thinking about other people other than yourself. Even on a trail, Try to stay on your side. Look at it as the same thing as a road. That don't mean you have to be exact. You know, nobody's expecting perfection, but just try to stay on your side as best you can. Uh, I know it's a trail and people think, you know, well, man, it's a trail, you know, good grief, lighten up. Yeah, but what happens whenever you got a group of people walking across the trail? What happens when you have someone walking dogs on a leash that lets the leash go out in front? What happens when you have people walking dogs that don't use a leash, which is a law? Things happen. Be courteous. Be kind. Hello. Hello. And that's another thing. Be friendly, be sociable. I know we're in a world and day and age where people don't know how to speak anymore and they get creeped out by someone saying hi to them or looking at them or what have you. But be sociable. Say hi, wave, how you doing? Have a good day, etc. Sometimes they say it back, sometimes they don't. Good morning. Another, uh, Hello. Uh, morning. Morning. Continue our ride. <clears throat> okay, now at a stop sign like this, I use my judgment. I use common sense. This is an open road. If you can see a half a mile down the road either direction, nobody's coming. There's no sense in stopping. However, there's a truck. So you can do a circle like so and wait and then go staying on your side of the road like a good person Well, it turned green for me, so I was free to go without any issues. But if that light had been red and there was still a car stopped right there, and my light I simply went around the right hand side of it, it was in the front, I went ahead and taken my turn. Totally acceptable. Sometimes the faster that we cyclists can get off the road, and show that we care a little bit about motorists as far as that goes the easier that they are to deal with so right here is one of those stop signs you can see there you can see over here so 
so and it's on a very side road uh, and right now it's not busy at all so uh, easing on through that stop sign is perfectly fine and again helps you to get out of the way a little quicker how you doing well there's Becky known her for a long time This light right here, I know, is fixing to change. Yep. Now. Damn this. So in this case, I went ahead and stopped. Oh, it's green. Good. Uh, in that case, I went ahead and stopped because there was traffic when, within a certain amount of distance. A lot of times on that light, uh, if I think it's safe, you know, you can see down the road both ways uh, a good distance. So uh, sometimes I'll ease through that one if it's red. Again, common sense. And again, it gets you out of the way quicker. Here we are. Here we are again. Stop sign. I'm gonna go through it. It's just a small little neighborhood. Small neighborhood, no traffic. Signs like that, you know, don't waste your time. Uh, just make sure you look both ways a couple of times. Make sure it's all clear. When you can see clearly and you're in small little areas like this, you know, common sense tells you to go ahead and go on through. <clears throat> Stop sign. Pay attention. See, that car was backing out of that driveway. Right there. So, pay attention to what you're doing. Pay attention to the motorists. Learn how to read traffic. Learn how to read the roads. And if we all work together, we should be able to have uh, a good time out here on the roads enjoying ourselves, whether we're in a car, bicycle, walking, or jogging. Guys, I'm a little ways from home, a couple miles. But I'm going to go ahead and sign off. That way I can concentrate more on the riding. If you have any questions or comments, concerns, anything, uh, leave, leave uh, comments in that down below. Like, share, subscribe. All that good stuff. I do all this for free. No monetization, no ads. So don't forget guys, get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it. Be courteous, be smart, common sense, and take care of one another. We're all out here together. We'll see you later.